Nothing like a Z. Oh, hey, Sheldon. Congratulate me. I'm officially one of you dirtbag shitheads. You got laid. No. I got fired. Hey, guys, look at this. Look at this. I'm still going, and I'm on my last name. That's a W? Shit on me. Shit. I ran out of piss. Stan, you like to give this up for me? Blow me. Oh, Jesus. Larry. What's up? Same shit, different ass. Well, after Wednesday, man, you are not gonna have to worry about a job. Yeah, or Laura. Or your mom. Or how about screw all of you? How much are we gonna get paid today? Well, according to my calculations. Oh, yeah, that's valid. Yeah, eat me. I estimate about 2,000, which breaks down to about 500 each. You know, give or take a few. Man, I'll call you up later, and I'll, I'll tell you what's going down. Right, right. <laughs> Uh, so you coming by for dinner tonight? Oh, I can't. Laura already made me a sandwich today. I'm gonna abuse that free meal ticket. I hear you. Man, after Wednesday, this town ain't never gonna be the same. Yeah, that's a relief. After 17 years, it kind of loses its charm. Oh, shit. We need to get out of here. Go where? Mom! Mom! I'm in here. I'm just finishing up dinner. Laurel, can I come in? I'm sorry, there's no law. Law. She's not here. Well, then whose voice am I hearing coming from your room? Read the sign. Okay. Laura, can I come in now? Yes, you may. So, you finally gave up on the name, huh? Why they don't have to give me a name that I wouldn't be able to pronounce? I don't even like that name. It's ugly. Laurel's a beautiful name. You have to say that. You're related. And besides, I've seen a lot more prettier girls with the name Laura. Laura, what would you do if I wasn't around here to take care of you? Where are you going? I was just wondering what you would do. Don't be silly, Shelton. You're not going anywhere. Oh, you've got my ring on. Yeah, I just found it the other day. Do you remember which ring is who? Yep. This one is me. This one's for Mom. And this one... And that one's me. Right. Just the three of us. Where's Davis? He's sleeping over there. How long's he been sleeping over there? Several days now. He hasn't moved to eat or anything. Mm. Laurel, I think Davis is dead. What are we supposed to do now? Well, I don't really know. I'll tell you what. For now, let's just cover him up with this piece of lettuce. Why? Well, it's, uh, it's a lot more respectful. Yeah, you see, if you cover the body, it keeps the soul warm before its long journey to heaven. See? There we go. Now that ought to do it. Doesn't he look a lot more peaceful that way? He looks more peaceful. Like he's really sleeping. Sleep tight, Davis. How you feeling, Mom? Fine. Dr. Lewis called today. Oh, yeah? So what's up? They've decided to stop my medication. Why is that? We owe them too much money. Huh? Well, shit, how much do you have left? None. You ran out? When was the last time you took your medication? Three weeks ago. Well, Jesus Christ, Mom, why didn't you tell me? Look, you can't, you can't keep pretending like I don't know anything about this. It's not fair to Laurel or me.